Hello, boys and girls. We are going to be celebrating the world of fish. Obviously, they're mentioned in Dr. Seuss's One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish, and they come in all shapes and sizes. And we could have some fun with creating some fish today. So I think our first step might be getting something to draw with, a pencil or a um, marker, crayon, whatever you have. And I think we could draw a line at the top of our paper. We can go either direction. And what I'd like to do is put like a line down to make a tank for some fish. So yours, I'm gonna make the bottom. And I think my tank is going to have a curved line. You don't have to have a curved line, but you could. Or you could have straight lines on a, on a fish tank. I'm going to have mine curving down. Here we go. Now, of course, don't worry about perfection. We don't need to be perfect. This is a hand drawing. Oh, now I've got my tank. I could put the little water line up at the top. Maybe I'll switch colors. You can show the level of the water. And now fish obviously come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. And we don't only have to make a red fish and a blue fish, but um, you decide. Now some fish might be swimming towards us with its face. Some fish might be swimming sideways. I'm going to try starting with a fish swimming this way. His head's going to be on this side. So the head is usually bigger, but not on all of them. And this fish, I'm going to draw one scoop line down. And then I'm actually making another little scoop for his big mouth. This one has a big mouth. You decide how you want yours to look. He's going to be smiley. Okay, and then I'm going to make his body go over, over, over. And of course, at the end, I think you know, at the end of a fish, they need a fin. All right. I think I'm going to work on setting up. Wait a second. All right, so I'm working on the fin here and I've got two lines up and it could be like an even triangle or you can dip in and out. I think, of course, we're gonna have to have a fin on top. It could go up and down. Just like a triangle. Of course, they have to have a fin on the side, up, I mean down and up. And I'm gonna put one on the bottom too. They need a lot of fins. And this time I'm gonna go twice. Down, up, down. And I'm kind of enjoying Dr. Seuss's drawings and how much personality he gives all his little fish and animals. So I'm gonna have really fun little eye here and maybe some eyelashes and some eyebrows to give it sort of some major personality smiley little guy here hello Ooh, he's got a lot of eyelashes and I'm gonna just make a little couple marks for the fin I'm uh, not the fins I'm so sorry the scales and maybe some lines on the fin these fins are very thin we might have a little textured lines. All right. Now, here's my one fish. And I'm going to do a set of two together. And maybe these fish can just be circular one. I didn't make a perfect circle, but it really doesn't matter. Fish come in all shapes and sizes. And then I'm going to draw a triangle at the end. But I'm making mine wavy with some lines, a fin going up, down. I'm gonna put a double triangle, two triangles on this fin. Up, down, up, down. And then a nice skinny fin here. And I wanna put a fin at the bottom. And these guys are gonna have their eyes closed. She's so sleepy. Maybe he's feeling sad. But this is going to be my two fish. So I have one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. I'm gonna, I want to kind of relate back to the book. 
you don't necessarily have to. But this is the two fish, so I'm going to put another fish right next to this fish. Circle go out and in. And they're kind of a pair. They're a little couple. I and I'm adding my lashes. I cannot wait to see what you're doing with yours. This one's happy. The other one feels sad. Oh, you're going to put some gills on here so he can breathe. Gills. And I wanted his fin to be the same. So up, down, up, down. Of course, there really are no mistakes in making fish because they come in all shapes and sizes. Some are skinny. Some are chubby. Some are big. Some are small. So I can't wait to see what you're doing with yours. Here's his fin, here's his fin. Okay, and they're moving around here. Maybe there's some bubbles coming up. Bubble, 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 bubble. And I want a fish to go maybe this way. So I'm going to make another head moving this direction. Here he is. Mouth, eyes. Ooh, he looks angry. <laughs> Eyelash. I'm putting eyelashes on these, just like in a Seuss book. You don't have to, obviously. He's got a little fuzz on his face. Oh, he's looking for a meal. And then I think I'm going to make this one longer. See how long his body is? And of course, I want to end with a tail fin, but I'm going to make this one fancy. Out, in, out, in, out, in. Ooh. You can try and work on some fancier fins if you'd like, but you don't have to. Out, in, out, in. And of course, I want to have a fin on the top of the fish. Out, in, out, in. Kind of nice soft triangles. Oh, hello, little angry fish. You might be my red fish. My fishy fish, my fish, my fish. All right. I might have one fit fish at the bottom facing us with a big smile on his face. So I'm going to make his head at the top. And then I'm going to end his body here with his belly, and then the fin is going to go this way. Over, and I'm going to make another triangle. Over, and hello little fish. Out and in, out and in. And maybe I'll make some marks on his body. A little bit of textured marks for fins on this surface, the bottom of my tank, I'm going to have some nice little rocks. You see sometimes in the tank, and this one's going to be looking at me with a big grin. You make your choices. There's no wrong way to do this. Just have fun and enjoy yourself while you're drawing. Oh, little guy. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. And I think I'm ready to color. Now my tank, I'm going to show the tabletop too. Here's the table going all the way over. And this is this side of the table. And I think I'm almost ready to color. If you'd like to uh, um, write one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, I'll put it up on the screen for you. But now, I think I'm going to color them in. Let's see. Two fish. And you can decide how you want to finish your work. Maybe you'll be using crayons, pastels, colored pencil, watercolors, you decide.
every day, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. That's a little word from Dr. Seuss, of course. Thank you, boys and girls. Enjoy yourselves.